What's up, guys? Uh, even chillier one today than it was the other morning. So when I got up to take the daughter to school this morning, it was a whopping 25 degrees outside. So going to be training today on the uh, frigid garage with shorts on because my joggers will be here later today. And uh, I'm hoping they don't fit like true joggers because my calves don't fit in true joggers. But any hoot, um, going to be training for um, some events training today, uh, specific for a competition that me and some buddies are hosting. So if you didn't catch the live stream the other night, me, Matt, and Corey are going to be putting on a competition with some uh, close friends and uh, not going to invite a lot of people, just uh, have a good get together with some good people. So we're going to uh, have five events. I came up with the events with uh, the help of Corey and um just with the equipment that we have um it's going to be at his his gym uh so with what he has and then what we could get there type of thing um so we're going to be doing a, a frame deadlift for max um we're going to be doing a uh, overhead press medley back and forth between a log and an axle those are going to be 200 pounds each and then a uh, yoke squat. So start in a almost squatted position and go into a lockout. So it won't be a full depth type squat, kind of like a half, um, like a low low pick on a squat So or on a yoke. So um, how we're going to measure that is 16 inches below shoulder height. And then uh, we're going to do a sandbag load over the yoke uh, for reps. So load the sandbag over, run around the other side of the yoke, load it back over, back and forth for as many uh, reps as you can in 60 seconds. And then the last event is going to be a uh, farmer's hold for time. So today I'm gonna train, uh, I'm gonna use my car deadlift frame for now until um, I make some adjustments with my, uh, my farmer slash frame and get that where i can use it so we're gonna do some car deadlift setup um side handle and uh it's pretty close to a frame um it's got a little bit different leverage with it but it's i have pretty much the same type of deadlift setup for both of those for my personal liking and um we're gonna do some holds with that then we'll get into doing some yoke picks and some um, axle and log pressing with, uh, if time gets to it. So I'm going to try to train four of those events today. If I don't get time to it, we'll at least get three of them done. So I'm going to start off with doing um, the frame, car frame deadlift, uh, work up to a decent weight on that, and then uh, take all the weight off and do just the frame of the tires for a hold for as long as possible. And then over to the yoke. All right, so I lied. I just went outside because I heard something blowing around. And, oh, jeez. Uh, I had a package sitting on the porch. Really early for deliveries for out in my area. So pretty excited that this came just in time for me to throw the sweatpants on and try them out for this workout. So let's do an unboxing, I guess, too, while we're at this. Could be a long video. I apologize ahead of time. So, I got a lot of freebies in this order. So, um, start off with the joggers. I already talked about those. So, might as well get them right out of the bag. All right. So, these were a new release a couple weeks ago. Redcon 1 joggers. Camouflage. So, can you guys see them? Joke. Cam camouflage joke, kind of like that. <sighs> All right, so next, let's talk about what I purchased. That was one. Um, let's see here. All right, next thing I purchased was the Zombie Blood Total War bundle. So I got the Zombie Blood pre workout and the Zombie Blood t-shirt 
So maybe we'll switch into that for the workout. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. So the next thing I bought was the breast cancer awareness bundle. So that came with a breast cancer awareness t-shirt. It's got pink high state of readiness on the sleeve and I see something on this sleeve. Maybe not on the back. Yep, the Red Con One Shield on the back. So very cool, very soft and lightweight material as always. And that came with a shaker cup. That's cool. I love shaker cups. So, and these are very nice shaker cups. This is a lot like the uh, the Black Friday deal one. The way the lid is set up on this one. So, and it says. Under, under the lid, just like the Black Friday one, says you are awesome. So that is awesome. Okay. And then the rest of the stuff was all free for spending money. Um, it was a little bit lighter weight than I thought it was gonna be, but that's fine. Redcon one hoodie. Uh, it says high estate readiness on the sleeve. That's got pretty heavy duty. What's got, wait. Oh, that's weird. Uh, it's got two draw, oh, two drawstrings in it. So <laughs> that's interesting. I've never seen a hoodie with uh, two drawstrings going through it. So that was free for spending 50 bucks. And then for spending $70, I got the Total War and Green Apple. And then because um, you can sign up and have reward points for uh, all your purchases, I spent 500 of my reward points and got a grunt in the tiger's blood flavor. So, is that everything? That looks like everything. So, I'm gonna try these sweatpants on. And the best thing about them, and I didn't know, is the drawstring is on outside of the waistband. So, that's something I prefer uh, on all my uh, sweatpants, gym shorts, stuff like that. So, yeah. Get these tried on, warm up a little bit. Bud. I'm lifting. Go back inside, bud. I'm loud. It's cold. Yeah, go back inside. <clears throat> huh? Go inside. Close the door. Okay, go inside. Go inside. Bye. Close the door. Goodbye. Okay,